hey my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon here so we're going to talk about LinkedIn how do you use LinkedIn to grow your business to generate income to, to 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 grow your connections to grow your online business or offline business or even just for jobs me I'm a development a DevOps I'm a development operate well DevOps is a is a discipline in the programming community if you will I'm a programmer with a speciality and uh, I, I work on the contract and other other than that I do the online stuff right the course income secrets so we're going to talk about how I'm using LinkedIn to get each of my contracts I get until um until I don't need them anymore but until then I still need I use LinkedIn a lot for that we're going to show you how I do that and how you can do that for jobs for contracts for things like that but also for your network marketing business for your affiliate marketing business for your online business for course selling all that stuff and show you how to use LinkedIn to get that kind of growth in your business but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so no matter what kind of business you have uh, social media is great to grow your business right LinkedIn is really more specific to business growth in, instead of social interaction and, and and you know like you'd see on Facebook for example or TikTok or or even Twitter I guess Twitter is a little bit more business oriented as well but still it's a lot less specific to business like LinkedIn is so we're going to show you how you can use LinkedIn and what are the why it's well you probably don't need to, I don't need to tell you why it's different you already know but this is let's just share the screen here and let's get to it <coughs> by the way before uh, I go on <coughs> if you're listening to the audio you might want to go check out the video at cis uh, cis302.jsgagnon.com to go check out the video and the blog post where I'm gonna get into more details with this or you're gonna be able to see things more than the audio right all right so on LinkedIn as you can see LinkedIn is a, a feed right if you go on LinkedIn you're going to see a feed of things that you know it's just it's just posts just like you would see on Facebook or anything like that right but that's not really why you use LinkedIn although it's important to post regularly on there as well because you're going to get seen people are going to notice you the platform is going to share you to other people's but lots of people don't go on LinkedIn to look at the feed they go on Facebook to look on the feed right they go on Instagram they go on 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 well maybe even TikTok right but the thing is that you can actually you, the, so the the secret the first thing you want to do is you know what let's talk about the, the things that you need to do before we even get to what I want to talk about the first thing you got to do is you got to set up your profile the right way you got to have a profile that uh, that people can see who what you're about what you've done why they should connect with you why because if if you do try to connect with people or contact them or things like that they need to be able to see that you're a real person you're not fake that you you have a background that they might be interested in or maybe interest that they might be interested in so to that end if you go to click ecourse and you go to courses um then you're going to see there's a LinkedIn um LinkedIn LinkedIn cannot connection secrets but we'll talk about that in a second the LinkedIn profile where is it where is it where is it LinkedIn profile secrets so LinkedIn profile secrets right here if you go to that that's a free course you can get it's it's really just a basic the things you got to do to set up your profile you know like things like um how to show um uh, sorry creating a LinkedIn account how to create the account obviously you probably don't need that but the basics of your profile becoming a lion and then um, and so it talks about those very basic things that you need to do and also gets you I guess introduced to me and how I teach and that kind of stuff but the, and the platform but all you got to do is here is you go to this uh, link let's open that up in the incognito so you can kind of see what it looks like if I go to there um you'll see that it's just a where is that's not right so there you go like this 
so you see that it's basically uh you just say log in to add right here but you can also watch the for the introduction to see what it's about but you just log in to add or you can uh, register if you if you don't already have an account you can just change on register instead right here and then you just enter either an email address or you continue with Facebook to register your account then you'll be able to watch all the all the different lessons in this course um so that's that's the first part right the first thing you got to do is set up oh sorry I just got to fix the screen I thought it was already done right there okay so the first part is setting up your profile you got to have your profile the right way if I go look at my profile you're going to see it's filled in you know I've got an about section I've got um well this doesn't show to anybody else but I've got uh, my experience here I've got my uh, work experience I've got my business experience my online my education my skills and endorsement I've got recommendations interest you know all that is all there so that people that want to connect they they see that I'm you know I've, I've took the time to make sure my profile is right so that's the first thing you want to do you want to make sure your profile is set up right then the next thing you got to do and that's not going to happen in a day you can set up your profile right away but then the next thing you got to do is you got to grow your network because one of the things with LinkedIn is if I do a search for say uh DevOps in my case my my business right you'll see that there's a ton of stuff if I just go on the, the, the people right <laughs> you'll see there's all these second connections second 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 say I didn't I didn't by the way I didn't connect with DevOps that's why there's a lot of second connections here but the thing is that if I just click on first it shows me who I'm connected with that are DevOps that are in my first level connection right I don't have that many well it's still 526 I guess there's quite a bit but that's only because I've got lots of connections if I go here and I say third or more then that'll show me people that I'm not connected to I can connect with them but I can't send them a message right if I go to Syed to Syed over here right oh he's a second second doesn't that's not what I wanted I said third or plus oh I must have not no that's weird okay anyways let's just look at these third ones second third there's a third okay right over here is a third connection if I go to this third connection right here I can't message them see it says with premium I could message him so I'd have to pay to message them I can still connect with him I don't know if I I don't know if I let's well whatever let's just do that you can add a note oh, okay right so I can connect to them still but the thing is that the chance of them accepting their connection is not as 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 high because they're a third connection which means I don't have any connections in common right uh because in LinkedIn your first level connections are people you're connected to right directly in your in your network second level connection are people that are connected to your first level connection so they're one level away from you and then third and plus is people that are not connected to your first level uh well third connection would mean that they're connected to your second level but not to your first or second right they're connected to your second level so they're third and fourth and etc right? but it just means it's further away from you in terms of number of connections between you and them right so that's third and plus but the thing is that LinkedIn has a, the a rule that you can't message somebody unless they're your I, is it first or second then they might have changed that I'm trying to remember if I go to a second connection here I can't even message them either right so I can't even message them that's kind of weird I thought you could actually message somebody who's you can't message them share profile in a message save follow report block unless it's this particular person let me just take a look at something here I just want to check another another second connection oh yeah okay so yeah so second connection you see if if they you can people can disable the ability to message them that's why that other person I couldn't message them but if they're your second or more you can't message them unless you pay for premium or you try it you know they gotta you gotta try before you buy kind of thing but you have to be if your first connection you can message people that's the secret the secret is getting first level connections so that you can message them like for me I can actually message right now recruiter let's just look up recruiters and let's look up my first level connections make sure I and as you can see I've got 2400 recruiters that are in my so I can actually message these people recruiter experts Canada let's uh, message this person here
so I'm just gonna say I'm just gonna ask this to this person you got any DevOps contracts these days and let's just say it like this there we go I'm gonna send another message see I can just go like this and I can actually message these people Ed Monda I just message this message too I've closed these I can message this one and it's r-e-r-a-e-g-a-n I'm gonna message this other one here so I'm just going to send these messages to a few people but I could actually send to 20 30 40 people right I mean obviously there's a just like any other platform there's a limit but I could send to 10 people in a day the next day another 10 right and the thing is that I have to have them in my network right so how do you get there how do you get to that so that's the next course of course this one is a course that I sell it's really not expensive but it's called LinkedIn connection growth secrets and that one shows you how to grow your LinkedIn connection by up to a thousand connections a day right so I've I was actually able to grow like I don't know if I have a do I have a I can't yeah I actually grew does it show over here there's some place where I actually explained that I grew by 1300 connections in one month when I was actually totally active doing this so as you can see now I have if I go to my network I have uh 16,000 connections right I have 16,000 connections and I've got all these people wanting to connect I got 300 380 invitations people wanting to connect with me that I haven't gone through that I haven't looked at if I was to look at this I, I normally would accept people that's got at least 160 connections well that's not how I did it in the beginning but now because I have so many connections I'll accept uh, people that have 100 100 or more connections in common with me and then otherwise I will look at people that have messaged message me maybe right I I don't know like some of these are fake uh, accounts right but these are all uh, messaging messaging me right uh 14 41 I'll have to look at these more but if I look at this one that's 151 uh, let's see do I have show more uh, let's see I have 12 21 7 right so I mean I've got uh, all people pages I got pages that invite invited me that's interesting nonprofit invited you to follow achieve huh. photos aspen that's interesting I guess people are inviting others to to like pages right hmm. but anyways that's a new thing and well not a new thing that new but it's been around for a while but you, it's something that's not as uh, for me anyways not as common I've got all these sent invitations as well I don't know how many how many do I have I've got only 16 that I sent to right this was a three weeks ago they're not bothering to accept um but anyways that's like that's the sent but anyway so that course again you just go to uh to course to click to click e-course you go look for LinkedIn connection growth secrets right LinkedIn connection growth secrets and that one there is 150 but I'm I'm gonna make you a special deal right now let's see what can I what can I do for you let me just let me just go out if you're watching this episode if you're listening to this audio or the video by the way don't forget go to the video right but you can get this course LinkedIn connection growth secrets for I'm gonna I'm gonna give it to you like insane $25 give it to you $25 all you got to do is you use this coupon it's good until the end of until the end I'm going to make this a coupon like all these coupons are here they might be uh, going away uh, but I've got this let's let's just give you this coupon so create so super super 25 all right it's going to be $25 all you got to do is you got to go to use the coupon super 25 and it's going to be until the end of um 2021 0228 all right so the end of February so depending on when you're seeing this when you're listening to this you might be able to get this or not um depends on you know but anyways it's super 25 dollars you get this course at 25 dollars you just put in this coupon in the page if I go uh, let me just show you kind of how that works if I just 
go here so when you go to this you just enter the coupon let's take the coupon out so without the coupon it shows up at at 150 well sorry I guess I gotta remove the coupon okay so without the coupon it shows up oh coupon equals I guess I gotta fix that is that gonna work okay there you go so there's no coupon here so okay so without the coupon it shows up at 150 but if you put the super 25 apply you get the deal at 25 dollars like I said it's only until the end of February 2021 so if you see this after that but well maybe there's another coupon there's going to be a pop-up here that's going to give you a deal if you try to leave it won't be this it won't be this good um but uh so this is at 75 dollars instead right so but you know at least you get a, a deal at less than 150 if you decide to check it in afterwards anyways that's that's going to show you how to grow your LinkedIn connections it's going to talk about the basics the engagement the groups the search and connect connection management and and of course there's a bonus here that shows how I, I did it like in, from in 2016 but it's different today obviously but anyway so that's the thing so once you have the connections once you have the connection then all you got to do is search for the kind of connection that you're like you got to message you can't just randomly message people hey can do you want to make money or whatever right you got to build a relationship just like any other um online or any other well even offline right if you're trying to build a business you're not going to go and just try to sell your stuff if you go to the barbecue or something right you're not just going to go sell your stuff there right? <laughs> you're going to actually have conversation with people show them you're interested in them show them that you're so what we do so for me for the recruiters uh it's not the same probably because that's what they're there for same thing with realtors if you're looking to buy a house uh you might want to you you could just connect with any realtors um, it's not exactly the same thing because well it's similar I suppose but in, anyways if the person is there for that then you can if especially if you're looking to buy something you're looking to make them some money right like as a recruiter they'll make money by placing me in a contract right so that that's what they're there for so I can spam them about contracts if they have anything right and ask them if they have anything um but if if I'm trying if I'm trying to sell something that I have if I'm trying to make some money like say I'm an affiliate or I'm in network marketing or I'm selling uh essential oils or CBD oil or I'm selling um, shampoo or whatever it is you can't just spam people about your product because that doesn't work it doesn't work on LinkedIn doesn't work on Facebook doesn't work on Twitter doesn't work on Instagram doesn't work anywhere so you can't do that but you can build relationship with people so <laughs> let's just say I say course uh creator let's say course creator if I search for course creator and I look up my people and I look up my connections my first connections only just so I can message them right I can see Monique Nero she's a she's a friend we've been we've had lots of conversations so I'm going to skip her but she's awesome by the way if you're looking for anybody who can help you with your course creation your content creation your organizing of your course all that stuff she's amazing just go ahead and reach out to her connect with her and let her know that I sent you um as well right okay so if I look at this copywriter for course creators okay I'm going to say uh thanks for letting me know uh look into this so this is somebody I actually messaged before about a whole bunch of stuff oh I didn't even realize that course creating so that's I'm gonna can I oh do this okay this is bigger I just want to see what I've been messaging this person Narisa uh to know how so so see so, so see she is basically she basically spammed me right she's talking to me right away about what she sells um I don't know what that's why that says that oh that's because it's a kind of a spam message another one but that's the thing right um so I'm I I didn't oh that's what happened I remember she just spammed me and I just replied back saying I just said so as you can see all I said is I said thanks right and then she spammed me something right so that's that's not how you want to do this right you want to go so let's just skip over this person and let's go to Mayan Mendoza Nino Marie Hunter 
uh, let's take a look at Marie Hunter if I just go to uh, this person I just go to their profile right so I just look at the profile just like any other do you know what this is the same thing as other social media you want to look at their profile you want to see what they're about and then you want to see so they got featured stuff here they got activity if I click on activity and I look at posts I will see what they actually post right so she shared this this she shared this from something destination British Columbia right um then it's going to be an instructor she says if you're BC based tourism want to take your digital marketing skills to the next level tourism digital academy um, joining destination BC tourism digital oh, this is very cool okay so she's talking about this digital activity this digital thing that was uh when was that one month ago two months ago three months ago three months ago so she was she was excited about this thing three months ago um and recently I guess she posted some more stuff two months ago so okay so now I got a kind of a feel for her that she's into digital um travel stuff right and I can actually message her saying um I can just say hi hi Marie how did the digital digital tourism so what is it digital tourism training uh, instructor bc based tourism business digital marketing skills digital tourism training go I'm just going to send that right so I just sent a message to connect with a person to get a feel for what they're about right I'm into course creation I've got a course hosting platform and I'm, I'm not going to just start spamming them about hey did you check my course hosting platform right because that's that's just going to invite that's not going to invite anybody to connect with me that's one of the things right you got to do that so if I go back let's say I go to another one who oh, is this current chair of the wellness at work initiative global wellness institute uh, that's not it I have online teachers and make courses more fun okay cool so let's look her up let's see so over here if I look at their profile more fun using using look-alike animated characters with a grain of salt oh. okay cool she does actually these things see all activity and you could this is one thing you could do too right I mean well I guess she just liked this so let's just post look at her post so she posted but she shared this shared 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 so these are shares they're not posts of the person and there's no there's she didn't put any comments she just shared it right um so that's not the same as if they posted I couldn't I could I could like their 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 content right and the other thing is I could message them and I could just say hi Annette and Nikki and Nikki uh, I can just say hope you have a great 2021 how goes the course course So I can just say that how do you create those characters and videos I could take more time to go through and look at this and whatever but that's the thing right I'm just kind of showing you that you want to connect based on what they're doing what they're about right millennials and boomers how COVID has impacted media consumption by generation huh. I wonder what that what does that look like can you see it more curious about that so video games online videos whoa Gen Z Millennials online videos Gen X broadcast TV huh. the boomers broadcast TV yeah that's interesting anyways whatever that's not, that's a side note just because of this thing I saw here um okay so if I go back now I can close these tabs because I don't need them anymore if I go back here I can go through I can look at another one innovative content creator and teacher with PhD in English volunteer experience creator producing co-hosting uh, probably not software support no 
uh award-winning photography no not really let's go to the next and that's the thing whenever you're searching you kind of have to look at what they do right uh freelance I help top execs and brands social uh that's in French product manager mission challenge content creator so I probably could search for something a little bit more like online online course online course online course online course writing coach I'm gonna write more words I, I did I message no I didn't okay uh, okay so there's another one so and this is the thing right you got to look at what they do that's basically the thing and that's the next level after you've got a bunch of connections you can use them you can connect them you can connect it like you can send a message to 10 different people every single day 20 people <laughs> I haven't really tried myself to be consistent with that because I've never really had a need to but I've been wanting to create a grow your business course on LinkedIn right and this might be the start of it is how to do that to connect you know what are the ways to connect um after you've got your connections without connections you can't really do much because you unless you pay for it right but even the, but if you pay for it people know that you paid for the the message because it shows that you're coming it's coming from a premium member right so it's kind of not as valuable as connecting um you know th through your direct connections if you already connect with them because they know that you're already connected right um so she hasn't posted anything but she does creative writing coach write more words why do I help who do I help I help writers and classic writers words. fear of writing online course oh cool fear of writing online course hmm. anyways I could message Millie here and and same thing right tell her something about what I see uh, watch the video this 10 minutes could change your life so she's got a thing here instead of it does that go straight to video oh, it says share no longer supported few original on YouTube oh, interesting okay slide share doesn't let you so yeah so that's how you grow your business you got to connect with people now afterwards you'll get conversations right and if you connect with enough people every single day and send messages to new people every day then over time probably a week you're going to start to have conversations with these people some of them that are going to go back and forth and even if you don't have a conversation right away you've had this initial connection and maybe you can bring it to the next level which is having a zoom or a phone call with them to help them with something that maybe they're struggling with trying to try to discover what they what you what you can give them that's the secret you got to find out what you can give them what you can do for them don't even worry about what they can do for you that comes later so you got to focus on that what you can do for them right don't think about what they can do for you you got to really think about what you can do for them do something for them what can you help them with when you look at whatever they're doing right and that's the secret find something that you can help somebody with and connect with them have conversations eventually have a live session a, a zoom or something right and then you can you can help them all right have yourself a great day and we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom Ooh. some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time